Hello. I am having problems with my shifting. The gears are skipping. Let's see if we can diagnose this. Are you having the problems in all of the gears, or just a few of them? Just a few of them, the smaller cogs in the back seem to skip, and it almost throws me off of the bike. That does sound like it needs some attention. Let me measure the chain. I bought the bike here, I would hope the chain is correct. I am measuring the chain to check for a chain wear. It is completely normal for a chain to elongate due to use. This is called chain stretch and it is the loosening up of the plates, rivets and bushings that make up a chain. No one told me about this. Well, it looks like your chain is very worn, and should have been replaced a long time ago. No one told me about this. When was the last time you brought this bike into the shop? I brought it in at the beginning of last year. No one told me the chain was stretched then. A year and a half is a long time to go without maintenance. The wear could have happened in between the time you brought the bike in, and now. No one told me that chain stretched. It also appears that your chain is under lubricated. There does not appear to be any lube on your chain whatsoever. The chain gets dirty shortly after I lubricate it. I don't want chain lube to get all over my car when I transport it. A chain needs to be lubricated or it will not function properly and wear out quicker. I want my chain to be shiny. I do not want to spend a lot of time cleaning it and adding lubricant to make my chain dirty. You need to lube your chain more often in the future. For now, we need to replace the chain. Will that solve the gear skipping problem? I'm not yet certain. Your chain could have worn the cogs in the back. A worn chain can prematurely wear out a cog set, that is why we recommend people change their chains every 1000 miles. I only have 500 miles on the bike. This bike shows a lot of wear for 500 miles of use, and the bike computer shows over 2000 miles. The computer was not working for a while, so the mileage is not right. The front wheel is on backwards, so the computer is not calculating mileage. This would mean the bike has more mileage, as it was not calculating since you last put your front wheel on. I had the computer put on here. It appears your cassette is worn out as well. It can't be. I bought it last month and haven't been riding my bicycle that much. The cassette is too large for this rear derailleur as well. Where did you get this cassette installed? I bought it from eBay and installed it myself. Well, a worn chain can wear out a brand new cassette in very few miles. It is recommended to replace a worn chain when replacing a cassette for this reason. I don't think that sounds right. The cassette is like new, the eBay seller said it was barely used, and it was shiny like it was new. The cassette can't be the problem. It is possible that the cassette was worn out, and the seller cleaned it to make it look new. The seller had 100% feedback. I trust him. Or her. I don't know for sure whether the seller is a man or a woman. At any rate, I trust I wasn't sold a worn out cassette. Did I mention it was shiny? Regardless, we need to replace the cassette, it is showing wear from being used with worn out chain. No one told me that the chain could wear out a cassette. Are you sure this can happen? Absolutely. A new chain and a cassette will be $100 with installation. I'm not paying that. I just want to have a skipping fixed. I need to speak to your manager, I am offended. Are you just offended because I am not giving you the answer you want to hear? Yes. I want my bicycle fixed. I do not want to pay for it. I bought the bicycle here. No one told me I needed to change my chain or lube my chain. And right now, you have offended me by wanting to charge me $100 for something you should do for free. I am not sure why you think you should not have to pay to have your bicycle fixed. I am also unsure as to how I have offended you. Furthermore, I am not quite sure how you get along in life without daily instructions about breathing, eating and sleeping, let alone more complicated tasks. I am going to write a letter to the company that makes my bicycle. My last bicycle was a regular bike, and the chain never wore out and it always worked perfectly. If you are not going to cover this work, they should. The manufacturer of your bicycle did not make the cassette or the chain. You know the parts you are currently having problems with. 
I'm not sure how writing them a letter would do any good. Maybe you should write a letter to the company that actually makes those parts. Be sure to let them know you prefer a clean unlubricated chain to a properly lubricated one. I need to speak to someone who can give me the answers I need to hear. You obviously do not know what you are talking about. Sir, you've been talking in circles and shifting responsibility to avoid any type of knowledge of wear on your bicycle. Are you trying to act confused to avoid having to admit any personal responsibility for lack of routine maintenance, and in turn avoid paying for any repairs to your bike, caused by your inability to understand how a bicycle works? Yes, that is it exactly. Now may I speak to your manager, 